Our next speaker this morning is our second sophomore, Juliana Q, who will be reciting Henry VII by Jane Murray and others.
help the economy in Spetsdania anymore. In the matter of courage, as well as ancestry, Henry VII had made his point at Bosworth Field. No one accused him of cowardice because he stayed at home and built up his country. When it was absolutely necessary to fight, he had sworn half the money that had been voted for his military expenses and pocketed the rest. But his finest hour came in 1492, when he received money from Parliament to fight France. Not only did he not fight France at all, but he also blackmailed the French king into paying him not to. Study if you can the face of Henry VII. Not the stylized bronze on his beautiful tomb, or the young picture holding the gilly flower, or the older picture with Tudor rose. In the crypt at Westminster Abbey is the effigy that was carried in his funeral procession, made unquestionably from his death mask. Look at this. You are looking at England's first modern 